Well, she's the uh, most inexpensive male wood miser makes. I've never ran one of the big ones. I've seen them in action, but I'll tell you this little this little thing right here. Wait till this truck goes by with its jake brake. There's uh, there's the lumber I need. More than enough to make the sawbuck. Well, in a log that should have been thrown away. Anybody and everybody else on the planet would have thrown that log right over the bank. And uh, there it is. Uh, for what I'm going to do with it. So I don't have to have a pile of that. Uh, that's pretty nice. Exceptional. And that's the inside of that old crappy hemlock. Just playing around. I wanted to see how accurate it was and how thin I could get it. And it's right down to just paper thin. Uh, she cuts beautiful. Couldn't ask for anything nicer. Read the newspaper through it. All right, time to cover it up. But uh, I never really thought I'd got gotten uh, that nice a lumber out of that old crappy. Hemlock. The, the uh, beam for my winch, I cut that log at the top of that tree. So this is probably not long lived, but I'm not going to be picking anything heavy up if I got a big log and I can't roll it by myself, which I don't think that's going to be an issue. Uh, in all likelihood, uh, I probably won't use that other than maybe to put a a choker around the bottom and a snatch block on it and run the cable down here to pull logs up onto a uh, platform so I can stage five or six logs on a platform right there and then just have a little bridge that'll just span the, the space right there where I can roll one log over the rest of most day so all right thanks for watching it's been a success I uh, hope you enjoyed it, and uh, once I get cutting real real logs, real lumber there, I'll uh, turn the camera back on. All right, thank you.